Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into a fascinating question. Do fish sleep? It's a topic that might have crossed your mind while watching your fin friends glide through the water. So, let's find out if fish really do catch some Zs. First things first, fish do sleep, but not in the way we typically think about sleep. They don't have eyelids, so you won't see them closing their eyes and curling up in a cozy bed. Instead, fish enter a restful state that's quite different from the sleep of land animals. This restful state is essential for their health and well-being, just as sleep is for us. So, how exactly do fish sleep? Fish have a unique way of resting. They slow down their movements, reduce their metabolism, and find a safe spot to relax. You might notice your fish hovering in one place, staying close to the bottom, or even hiding in a favorite nook. This is their version of sleep. They become less active, and their bodily functions slow down, allowing them to conserve energy. During this restful state, fish remain alert to their surroundings. This is crucial because, unlike humans who can afford to completely shut down and enter a deep sleep, fish need to stay somewhat vigilant to protect themselves from predators. So, even when they appear to be resting, they're still aware of what's happening around them. It's like they're in a light sleep, always ready to spring into action if needed. Now, you might wonder if all fish sleep the same way. Well, the answer is no. Fish don't have a set sleep schedule like humans. Their sleep patterns can vary based on species, environment, and even the time of day. For instance, nocturnal fish are more active at night and rest during the day, while diurnal fish do the opposite. Some fish might even take short naps throughout the day rather than having a long, continuous sleep period. Let's talk about some interesting examples. Some species, like the parrotfish, have even developed special sleeping behaviors. Parrotfish secrete a mucus cocoon around themselves to protect from predators and parasites while they rest. How cool is that? This mucus bubble acts like a sleeping bag, providing a layer of protection and helping them stay safe during their resting period. Another fascinating example is the way some fish use their environment to aid their sleep. For example, some fish seek out crevices or burrow into the sand to hide and rest. This not only gives them a sense of security, but also helps them stay out of sight from potential predators. Fish sleep is also influenced by their environment. In captivity, providing a consistent light-dark cycle can help your fish establish a regular resting routine. It's important to mimic natural conditions to keep your fish healthy and stress-free. If you have a home aquarium, try to create a natural day-night cycle by turning the lights on and off at regular intervals. This helps your fish understand when it's time to be active and when it's time to rest. It's also important to note that fish in the wild might experience different sleep patterns based on their habitat. For instance, fish living in the deep sea, where it's dark all the time, might have different sleep behaviors compared to fish living in shallow, well-lit waters. The availability of light and the presence of predators can significantly influence how and when fish sleep. So, in conclusion, yes, fish do sleep but it's quite different from how we sleep. They enter a restful state, remain alert, and have unique behaviors to ensure their safety. Next time you see your fish being still, remember they're just taking a little break. Understanding fish sleep can help you better care for your aquatic pets and appreciate the incredible adaptations they have developed to survive and thrive in their environments. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button for more fascinating insights into the world of fish and let us know in the comments if you have any other questions about our aquatic friends. Until next time, keep exploring and stay curious.